are better ways to keep cool. Call KS Services and receive a new Bryant unit with no payments and no interest for 18 months. Stay cool now and pay later. Visit callks.com for more. It's the Weather Extreme video. This is the morning edition. This is for Friday, the 4th of September. I'm James Spann. Alabama's weather will stay pretty quiet through the upcoming holiday weekend. Shower chances increasing next week in advance of a front. Can that thing push through Alabama? We'll see. Here we go. This is the upper look this morning. Got a big old upper high. Big old heat bubble back over the western states. Troughing north of the state. That'll push a surface boundary through here tonight. Should come through in dry fashion with only a few very isolated showers. That was the radar this morning at 446. Nothing happening. And again, most locations will be dry today. We are in the 70s for the most part early this morning. Aniana, the one exception. They've got 67 highs today at or just over 90. On the watch warning map, we've got excessive heat warnings for much of the west. The eastern half of the country pretty quiet. No severe weather expected around the nation today on an organized basis. But tomorrow, there's a risk of severe storms over parts of the upper Midwest and the Corn Belt. And Sunday, again, a marginal risk from Des Moines back over toward Detroit. Here's the rain for the next seven days. The heavier totals holding north and west of the state. Really not a lot here, under a quarter of an inch if this verifies. But again, we do expect to see an increase in the number of scattered showers and storms by the middle part of next week. In the tropics, got one little feature up in the North Atlantic that's uh, moving northeast. That's obviously no threat to the United States. The focus is on the Eastern Atlantic. This is the five-day outlook in the Hurricane Center showing three distinct waves out there with a medium to high chance of becoming either a depression or a storm within five days. But their way out there remains to be seen if they affect the United States. Something to watch for now. The good news, the Gulf of Mexico will stay very quiet through the Labor Day weekend. So, model fans, let's go. Here's the GFS, the 06E run, 4 o'clock today. Got a big old 597 heat bubble over the west where they'll be blazing. 591 ridge here, troughing to the north. And, again, a little surface front should be near Nashville. And that might kick off a few isolated showers, mainly over the Tennessee Valley this evening. But with limited moisture, not much rain. And uh, south of the valley, don't think it rains at all. In the high today, low 90s. Then tomorrow, as the front pushes on through, highs will drop into the 80s and the dew points come down. Dew points could be in the 50s during the day. So that's going to be a really nice day tomorrow. Mostly sunny, very pleasant. Again, uh, the GFS Moss and the NAM Moss showing 85 for Birmingham tomorrow. That's really nice. Sunday, we'll be down in the 60s to start the day. Pretty pleasant, mid-60s. High Sunday, upper 80s, and there might be a few isolated showers over east or southeast Alabama, but again, most places dry. Labor Day will bring in the chance of a few scattered afternoon showers, partly sunny, highs mid to upper 80s. And then next week, big old trough digging in the western states, and look at the snow coming down in Colorado. Tis the season for them, but for us, we'll have scattered showers and storms. Same thing Wednesday and the same thing Thursday. Not a washout these days, but uh, scattered showers and storms, a mix of sun and clouds with highs in the 80s. Now, this is the end of the week, and again, the models have been trending westward with this trough, which will probably hold that front a little west of the state. Uh, The front uh, near the northwest corner of the state. So uh, if this verifies, we'll have to hold the chance of scattered showers and storms in the forecast through the end of next week with those lows in the 50s kind of on hold. And we'll go out 10 days. This is Sunday the 13th, troughing to the north and the front, uh, still having a hard time pushing through. It's kind of lined up over the central part of the state with drier air north and west of there. Rain for Birmingham off the European Ensemble for the next 15 days. Not much. The mean is under one inch. But some of the members are up to over two inches. Temperatures, you can see the numbers coming down into the mid-80s, low 80s out there in about a week or so. Lows in the 60s, but again, with the trough trending west, that will kind of keep that core of the really cool air a bit west of here. CPC outlook, this is September 11th through the 17th, showing temperatures here a little below average. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this morning. We'll have notes on the blog. The next video here by 4 o'clock this afternoon. You can catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and God bless. 
Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today.